I mentioned the areas out on the sides for the harms. It's going to be about uh, a foot wide and about three inches deep. And there are four arms, and I can put the arms on there. It will take two hours to hold the arms in place so that I can start forming the arms. I got that. The arms no. right here. Um, they're not proportional. <coughs> they're kind of room deep. They're kind of all over the place. Um, I'll show you what I did here. This morning, I went over to this area with a chainsaw, blocked all these things out of here. These are, these are all the stuff that you see here, and all along there. Well, no, it's just a matter of cleaning it up with your lip abs. It's called the lip abs. And just going over and smoothing up so I could remeasure it and do it again. Oh my gosh. If you want to ask me questions, go right ahead. Did you learn the skill of doing this? I did an apprenticeship. Out of the 23 years I've been carving, Ken went into an apprenticeship. Oh. Are there particular um, animals that you carve? Or, you know, that um, Obviously. Yeah, the company asked me to make a bear this year. This year, okay. So yeah. just a territorial pole. Yeah, sure, yeah, bear territory. Yeah. How long did this part take you so far? So far, it's been two months and four days. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Wow. I'm counting. Wow. How long will it take? Let's see. About mid August, it should be finished. Yeah, it's, it's really close to being done. Everything's here now. We have the arms and the snout. The bear is pretty much all carved, but not totally. But it's all there. Is you painted that? Or, uh... My wife will do that for me. I haven't painted a pole in a long time. <laughs> it's been quite a while. Where is it going? Up on the bear trail. Um, it's a territorial pole. I don't know.